Hey, how's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another brand new video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get potato graphics in Fortnite Chapter 2 Remix. I hope this guide helps you out, so make sure to stick around till the end because this is the only guide you'll ever need. With all that said, let's get started with the intro. Alright, so step number one to the potato graphics is downloading the Fortnite Chapter 2 Remix Potato Graphics Pack. I'll be leaving a link to this down in the description below. This file is really important because it contains all of the settings that you will need to do that. Once you're over here, the first folder is the NVIDIA Profile Inspector where you'll find the NVIDIA Profile Inspector.exe. What you have to do is simply double click to open this thing up and click on No to reset the window positions. It will open up this application in front of you where you will see all of your NVIDIA control panel settings this application makes importing the nvidia control panel settings really easy so once you're here simply look up for fortnite on your pc and once you have selected the fortnite file click on import user defined profiles button over here click on import profiles and go to the folder where you have kept the potato graphics pack once you're here open up the nvidia gpu folder and import the fortnite.nib file in here once it is imported simply click on ok and then you need to click on apply changes this will apply all of the best settings for fortnite on your pc once that is done simply click on close well before moving ahead i would like to introduce you all to gvg mall a store which fulfills all your digital needs for games and gift cards in one place gvg mall has a wide variety of digital keys for games and in-game currency for multiple vendors which is legit reliable and convenient on the website you can find a lot of categories where you can get steam and origin as well as pc game gift cards and genuine windows activation key i however liked how convenient it is to get a genuine windows key since i do not like the activate windows watermark on my screen and to fix it i can literally get a windows key for a huge discount generally you can get windows 10 for 5378 but on this sale you can get it for 2175 and if you use my code fox25 you can get additional 25 percent off at just 1631 and you also have windows 11 update for free and it is perfect time to get rid of that windows activation mark Mark. There are multi bit payment methods which are convenient and once you buy it, you will get an email within minutes and using that code, you can activate your windows in no time. So go check out GVG Mall, links are in the description below. Now once again, by any chance if you do not have an NVIDIA graphic card, you have an AMD GPU, open this folder and you'll find in game user settings. Simply open it up and you'll find game user settings.ini. What you have to do is press Windows and R key all together and this will open up run on your PC. Simply type in app data over here and this will open up app data. Head over to local and look up for Fortnite in this list. You'll find Fortnite games, open it up, go to saved, go over to config, windows client and you'll find in game user settings.ini. I would recommend you guys to control C to copy a backup for this file and keep it on your desktop just to safeguard any changes that you don't want. Then you have to copy the game user settings.ini from the potato graphics pack and paste it in the saved directory folder over here and click on replace the file destination. I would recommend to do this even for the nvidia users just in case you want to get rid of the best in game settings part once that is done simply close it after that you're gonna have to open up epic games on your pc and launch your fortnite game once you open up your game you will notice that it will open up fortnite in a windowed mode Okay, once you're on your home screen, head over to the settings part of your PC and then change your windowed mode to full screen and your native resolution to your monitor resolution. Then scroll a little bit down and set your 3D resolution up to 85%. If you have a super low end PC, go down to 80%. But if you have a little bit stronger PC, you can go with 100% right over here. You don't have to change any other settings. Head over to the sound settings over here and then for the sound quality, make sure that it is set to low click on apply and this will open up your game on full screen once that is done click on keep changes and you guys can see now your game is right here let me just drop into the game and show you quickly what are the things that changed before and after Guys, that was it for this video. I hope I could have helped you out. If I could have, make sure to do be back and smash that subscribe button. It really helps me grow the channel. And we'll see you all in another amazing video. Until then, stay tuned. Keep watching Empire Fox and peace out.